The, where the, idea, the thing would work is that you abolish all tax allowances, mm. tax credits, tax bans. You effectively abolish social welfare. You may have to have special provision for the elderly and the ill. Uh, you figure out how much that gives you. You can figure out from that you know, how much of a basic income you could pay. And of course, that'll depend on what, what, what tax you want to charge on people who earn above the basic income, who earn, who earn money apart from the basic income. Okay. So basically, a lot of work has been done on that. There's a government uh, green paper on it dating back about nine, ten years. And uh, I, they, they concluded, despite some, some initial reaction to what I said down today, I met you down at all. Mm. Uh, it was, it, it, I mean, the, the, the conclusion of the, of the um, committee that, that, that drew up the Green Paper was that such a thing was feasible. Okay. Uh, what, we want to, what we're proposing is we set up a commission to sort of run the numbers and give us the options within six months. Okay. Can we go to figure that? Well, I mean, you must have worked that yourself. Oh yeah, yeah. well, well, yeah. very, very well. I mean, to say, if if you had a, if you had a figure, we'll say that equates to present rates of social welfare, mm. if you are uh, or, or something roughly equivalent to that, mm. I think that the tax rate on the balance uh, of income, the income people would would earn in their own right by working, mm. would be sufficient. To, it wouldn't be it wouldn't be too high to to disincentivise people, and well, it would be sufficient to maintain that sort of a. This is the key issue, isn't it? Mm. The, the SRI there was an SRI paper on it which let, said it would lead to a kind of a fall in employment and a reduction in productivity because people wouldn't, if they knew that they had this income coming in mm. every month, they wouldn't necessarily be incentivised to work. Well, I and think, it, but that, that paper also said that you need to mm. increase tax to pay for it or find the income from other government expenditure because you're you're talking about the state laying out a huge amount of money for every citizen, did not you say? Well, you are, but you're, you're talking about laying, the state laying it out. The state is laying out a huge amount of money for, for, yeah. for citizens and the social welfare thing. The state is laying out a huge amount of money in, in, in giving tax allowances and tax credits. I mean, you, you know, you, that amount of money will be available to you. Mm. And I know, well, I'd be fairly confident, uh, this is, you know, in, in advance of the figures, but I'd be pretty confident that you take that sum of money together that, you know, you, you wouldn't necessarily need to increase tax. Uh, you, 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 I mean, you, you wouldn't reduce uh, the disposable income people have as a result of working now. Okay. Still though, no figure. You haven't got a figure. Mm, well, 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 as I said, the reason we are setting up a commission of experts, and I have s some names in mind, is to come up with the figures. I mean, to say, you know, you can, if you say th th the figure for tax on earned income will be X amount, then you can pay Y by way of basic income. If it's X plus, you can pay Y plus, you know? <laughs> All right.